So this craft is yarn butterflies and here's what a finished product looks like. For this, you're going to need a pipe cleaner, two popsicle sticks, some scissors, some yarn, and you could choose between doing multiple colors of yarn or just doing one color. It's really up to you. I actually have one color, but it's a bunch of different colors in one yarn. So I'm gonna be using this. And then a bigger bead and these two smaller beads. So to begin, you're gonna take your two popsicle sticks and you're gonna cross them over and make an X. Also, I do not recommend cutting your yarn prior to using it to wrap around the popsicle sticks because you don't really know how much you're gonna need. So I just keep it all in one piece until I'm done and then I just cut it off. An X out of the popsicle sticks, you're gonna take your yarn and you're gonna start wrapping it around. There's no specific way that you have to wrap it. Just make sure you do it in a bunch of different directions to ensure that the X isn't going anywhere. And make sure you do it tightly. So once you've done a pretty good amount in the middle, just to secure the X so the popsicle sticks aren't really moving, that's when you can start wrapping around the other parts of the popsicle sticks. So you can start off on one side by just going straight around the popsicle sticks with the yarn. And once you get to a big gap between them, that's when you can start to do a figure eight. So you're gonna go over the top, through, and then around the bottom. And you're gonna continue doing this until you've reached the end of the two popsicle sticks. And make sure you wrap it around very tightly. Again, it doesn't really matter which way you're wrapping it as long as you're crossing it in a sort of figure eight motion. Now, once you get to the end of one of the sides, you can leave a little bit of excess popsicle stick showing, and then you can go to cross over to the other side and just start doing the same thing on that side with the figure eight motion. Okay, so now that on both sides, there's an even amount of popsicle stick showing, you can cut off the excess yarn. And so that it's not showing, you could either tie a small knot in it or you could tuck it underneath some other pieces just so it blends in with the rest of it. So now that my piece is tucked in, it looks like this. And from there, you're gonna take your pipe cleaner and you're gonna fold it in half. So these two pieces are gonna go around the sides of this. So the two open pieces are gonna be the top, the antenna, the antennas of the butterfly. So once you have your butterfly through the pipe cleaner, you're going to twist it around once or twice. But you want to make sure to leave some excess room at the bottom. So if it's easier, you can squeeze it at the bottom and then with the remaining pipe cleaner, you twist it around. Now, before you bend these top pieces into the shapes of the antenna, 
you're gonna put the big bead over the both of them. Once you get your bead through, you can take your two antennas and shape them by kind of just rolling them inward. And it's okay if they're uneven. Mine aren't exactly perfect. So then from there, with the bottom, that's where you add your two smaller beads. So something I really recommend for getting the bottom bead slash beads on there is twisting the pipe cleaner several times to make it as tiny as possible. And you can also use the scissors to try to fidget the hole to get a little bit wider because it is a bit difficult, but you can add one or two beads onto the bottom and then you have your butterfly. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this craft.